Oh, whoops. And yeah. Filthy monster. Let me actually pick that up really quick. There we go. I think. Oh, is that a big guy? Oh, they're climbing up now. They'll probably come from both sides, too. Eventually. You gotta love it when uh, secondary characters have unlimited ammo. Yeah! Wait, you're supposed to be dead. Oh, more of them. I think, I think I'm out of flares. I think he just took a hatchet to the head and just says, keep coming. Well, I'm dead. Hey, buddy, help me. Help me out over here. Alright, I think that's all of them. Ugh, goodness. Are we all done? Let's cut the act now. Where's my wife? I knew you were gonna say that. I read it all before. You're a hell of a writer. Congratulations. You're gonna bring about something glorious and terrible once we get you some uh, proper editorial control. What the hell are you talking about? Where's Alice? I want the entire manuscript, or she's gonna suffer bad. You touch her all. Only Alan Wake knocks himself off a cliff no, trying to punch a guy. I swear I'll kill you if you hurt Alice. Do you hear me? Come back here. Uh, I have to say so far this he game Alice, and he is okay. He thought it held some magical power, but I had no manuscript to give him. I had to get back to Barry and figure out my next move. Like the thing is, I don't know. The uh the main character, I don't really like him that much. Occasion, Alice had tried to explain to me how it felt to be afraid of the dark. To her, darkness wasn't simply the absence of light, but something more tangible than that. It was something you could touch and feel. Worse than that, it was something with a mind of its own, something malicious and malign. For her, things changed when they were wrapped in darkness. They turned into something else, something foreign. And nothing was safe or innocent anymore. I'd never really understood what she meant. Until now. Hmm. Well. Whoa. So I guess we're going back to Barry, not chasing after that random guy. How does Alice sleep? Does she not turn off the lights? Uh, bear traps. So, let's see. This way doesn't really look like it leads to anything, which leads me to believe that there's something hidden around here. Hello? Nothing? Nothing at all? Wow. Well, never mind. Well, back on the trail. Sorry for the wasted time. I thought for sure there would be something there, though. Alright. Back to Barry. Whatever might have happened to him. I feel like he might be dead by the time we... Oh! I feel like I was supposed to do that. Ah! Not stuck anymore. Ah! 
Alright. Let's turn this back on. Get another battery. And I'll be careful of the bear traps now. I feel like your leg would just not be the same. I feel like he wouldn't be able to run. Not that he was doing much running in the first place, though. No pages? Just bear traps? That's what I thought it was originally, a page. My goodness, somebody wanted bears around here. Oh, whoopsie. Oh, there we go. Thanks, fellow hiker. Can I, like, jump over them? Alright, now this is ammo. No more bear traps. Good. Uh... Nothing around here. Somebody likes to stack beer around here, too. Eh. Oh well, I'm not gonna shoot it. Learn my lesson about wasting bullets. Alright, let's get up here. This cleverly stacked tree. What a coincidence. Alright, now where's Barry? Whoa, 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 where did you come from? Alright, good. There's someone down there, someone over there. I think that's it. There we go. Uh-oh. Put your flare out. There we go. And where's that other guy? Actually, there are a couple of them. Whoops. Who is that old lady and what does she want with me? Uh oh. Die, die. There we go. Alright, hopefully we can get back to Barry and stop playing this little game of flashlight and shoot. Hey, is this the cabin? I feel like I might be missing a lot of pages, but I'm not too concerned about that right now. Uh oh. Oh, that's just great. Oh. Hey, at least I started it. That's good. There's a page. What happened? Oh, well, that's interesting. Alright. Let's see that. Wake, wake, here's a chainsaw. The night had been one desperate situation after another. I was exhausted, and my body felt as though it had been chewed up and spat out. The flashlight was heavy in my hand, and each pull of the trigger sent a painful shock up my arm. But I was finally out of the woods, and things were looking up. That's when I heard the chainsaw. Ooh. Probably another little boss. Hunting rifle. Okay. You know things are bad when someone starts changing the pitch of their voice. Alright, what's in here? Oh, coffee. Nothing else. Alright, let's go. Might as well. Oh, so I have to jump off there, so it's a point of no return. Focus. I had heard the plane fall. It made no sense. It was clear that it had just fallen, in, but it was very old and obviously hadn't flown in decades. Looking at it, I sent a shiver down the spine. Hmm. Hey, -o. more flares. Uh, anything else down here? 
Oh, I, I don't go that way? Let me check out the plane then. It's obvious that that's important. Is there anyone up here? Just darkness. Well, let's go inside. See what's up here. Is that it? Um, where did the arrows point? Was it up here? Arrows. Where did you go? Um, not really sure. The plane obviously did nothing. Although, maybe there's something on top of the plane. Maybe I need to go over here and, like, jump onto the wing. Oh, come on, Alan. Uh, maybe jump onto this rock? No, what am I thinking? Alan can't jump. Uh, maybe up here? Aha! A torch. All right, let's open her up. Is that it? Two flares. After moving a plane to get to this thing? Oh well. All right, Barry. I hope you're okay. You're the only one that can help me. Alright, I'm trying to see what kind of guys we have around here. There's the hunter guy. I thought I saw another little, like, sp splicer looking guy. No, you're just the hunter. Is that it? Is that all of them? Okay. Oh, no. Whoa, more... Hey, thanks for the warning. Alright, come on. Whoa, what's going on with the mouse here? Yeah! Yeah! Alright, let's get back on the trail. This is kind of annoying. Here's a light. Why can't I use that? Yeah! Yeah! Alright, thank goodness. Hunting rifle ammo, revolver ammo. I wonder how close I am to finishing this game. I'm kind of anxious, too. I don't know. I don't know if I like it or not. The gameplay is kind of meh. Go here. Go there. Shoot this guy. Flashlight this guy. The characters? Meh. Alan Wake is kind of just annoying. At how self-obsessed he is. And then all the other supporting characters. Like Alice's little childlike irrational fear of the darkness. Barry. The typical like... Odd. Kind of fat best friend who is obsessed with women. Uh, I don't know. Not, not too much else. I'm not really sure, like, you know how some things you won't, you wonder, like, why is this happening? What's going to happen? I, I don't know. I don't really get the feeling with this game. It's kind of just like, well, oh well, whatever happens, happens. If Alan Wake dies, then Alan Wake dies. I don't know. Maybe it'll get better. I don't know what your you guys is use guys' opinion of this game is, but it seemed interesting and it was like two dollars on Steam at the time. So I figured, what the heck? 
Alright, I'm guessing we should go to this little mill over here. Oh, surprise! It's the hunter guy. Oh, and now they changed the pitch of their voice again. I kind of liked it better when it was just like that stucky guy. Just one guy. It was a lot more scary when you had just one guy and not the same like two every few feet. Kind of want to shoot that thing. Too bad it's just a watering can. Alright, to the house. Checkpoint reached. You know something's going down. Oh, what the hell? Alright, here we go. We, we were able to cross this time. I guess it's time to go inside. Nothing really to get out here. Come on. Uh. Did I get hurt from the darkness? Okay. Guess I won't be stepping on that then. Oh, that's all I have to do? Okay. Um. Is there anything in here? Or is this just a waste of time? Is this game a metaphor for racism? We will never know. Alright. Deputies. The logging site was a mess. The modular office had been pushed off the cliff. Deputy Thornton climbed up from the wreckage, excited, breathing hard from the exertion. Nobody there. It's weird. Don't you think that's weird? Bored, Mulligan let out a mighty snort. Hell, it's always weird, Thornton. Just a question of sorting out what kind of weird it is this time around. Mulligan? Who are these people? Never heard of them. Alright, let's continue up the stairs. To nothing. Oh. Ooh, a little bit of platforming. No, not really. Well, maybe. When Barry saw the darkness attack the visitor center, it made him a believer. The men Al said he'd shot, they hadn't been just locals on crank. Somehow the world had changed, like the channel had been switched without warning. You think you're watching a sitcom, and you're really watching a horror show. When the birds started attacking the cabin, Barry wasn't surprised, just terrified. Just terrified. I'm not going to waste my batteries on this thing. Oh, flares, you know what that means. It's about to be a swarm of them. Another coffee cup. Mm-hmm. Uh, do I need to go near the window? Or maybe climb up something? Or maybe going downstairs was the right way to go? Not really sure. What the? Okay, Alan. Am I going to die from stepping into a puddle of liquid? Alright, I, I thought this was the way to go. Like, maybe climb onto the boxes and climb onto that stuff. So let's go check it out. Alright, barrel. No barrel. Let me climb onto you. Maybe the box. Alright, Alan. Am I 
I'm gonna try to climb onto the barrel, but I'm probably gonna wind up. Alan! Oh my. 